guys welcome welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is Felicia everybody calls me Flick in today's video as you can see by the title we are using everything from the April budget box um, from the grab your shit and go collection uh, you might be able to see I've put the case up there um, it deserves to go on display it's, it's gorgeous but yeah we've got the primer the setting spray the face palette the lipstick palette the mascara the only thing I didn't use um, is the lip conditioner and lip oil duo purely because I don't really get on with the tingle formulas it's just not for me so yeah I've used everything else and if you would like to see how I got on with it all then keep on watching right so we have got the new what is it? get a grip gripping primer so let's give this a try That smells nice, whatever that smells. It smells nice. So far, a little goes a long way. I want to know what that scent is. It smells nice, whatever it is, it smells nice. Okay, give that a second to settle. Yep. That's a gripping one, alright. We are going to go back in with HMB because I actually really like that. I'm thinking because it is a gripping primer, a different brush would be better today. Let's try this one. So, kabuki brush. I feel like a stamping motion would be better than swiping. So, I'm going to take that. If I'd have thought about it, I would have got a sponge, but oh well. Okay, well that seems to be sitting nicely on top of that primer, so that's good. I really hope this um like this foundation lights this one <laughs> okay so far all right i look a bit bad let's turn this light down a bit So, obviously, I look a little bit pale. That's fine. So, we're going to take the SF2W concealer, just the slightly darker one that I've got. I'm not really looking to brighten today, to be fair. I don't know. I feel like next week we're going to be back to colourful looks. Let me turn that a little bit. Yeah, next week we'll be back to more colourful looks. I know everything's been quite like neutral around here recently and that, that is not my style you guys will know that if you've been around for a little while normally I avoid neutral <laughs> looks I like you know bright colorful Okie dokie. So, we've got the all over the place face palette. Now this has got everything. This is blush, bronze, cream blush and highlight. This is what it looks like. I feel like I'm going to use the lighter peach. I'll probably use everything on the lighter row to be fair. Um, so yeah, let's get some brushes out, shall we? I'm going to bronze first. I'll take the lighter of the two and take a very light hand because I don't want to go overboard because I underestimated the powder I learnt the hard way one too many times do not underestimate the pigment within like bronzes and blushes 
because it never ends well. Just go in with a slightly lighter hand and build it up if you need to. Just realised I should have done that cream blush first. Oh well, we'll be careful with placement. Um, so yeah, I'm taking the lighter one on the top row. I think this is probably the wrong brush to use, but we're in it now. And actually, actually that could be worse. That's a nice colour, and then I'll take the powder one next to it. I'm literally using everything in the top row. Go in with the translucent powder in a minute and just set the rest of my face. Like this, I don't know what's going on with this light. But this side always looks ridiculous on camera. And in real life it looks fine. Um, right, before I do the highlight, let's just take another powder. Um, do you know what, while we're here, let's take the HMB powder. The pressed powder in fair. I'll use a powder puff with it this time. What I'll do is I'll take a fluffier brush and I'll just lightly go over my face with the powder on a fluffier brush. And then highlight again. Taking the one on the top row. God, I love Peter Wee's highlights. It's always so pretty. Just real, I didn't do ones on my nose, so we're gonna take a tiny, tiny, tiny bit and just. Uh, That's looking nice. Yay. <laughs> okay. Um, I need to do something with my eyes. I'm going to do what I usually do and just be really lazy. Might as well do it while you're on screen, camera. What? While I'm on camera. Why was that so difficult? Seriously, what is wrong with me today? Uh, let's take a fluffy brush. And take the bronzer. Again, if you've been around a while, you will know this is something I like to do quite a bit. This is what I call my lazy makeup or my traveling makeup because I literally use my face palette for my face, for my eyes, less things to travel with. And then I'll take a packing brush and we're going to take the light peach shade on the inner portion. Actually, now we're going to take the bigger end of that brush. And then I'll just take that bit of that bronzer again. Just 
sweet. Might as well take the highlighter on that same brush. We're not going for like perfection and precision today. We are going for quick, easy, makes me look like I'm awake. I'm not half asleep. Okay, I'm going to quickly run off and do a couple of other bits and we'll be back to use the face palette, uh, no, the lip palette and the setting spray. So I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so I've sorted out my mascara and stuff. Now we are on to lips. So this is the gorgeous lip palette we've got this time. And it's like very nude, but also kind of a few pinky tones as well. It's got a really nice like depth to it all as well so let's pick the lip liner i don't want anything too dark but i also don't want anything too light i think i might go with on the edge mm, yeah let's go with on the edge it's kind of like in the middle let's try this one Maybe I should have gone in with a spotty dark one. Yeah, I think I should have gone with a slightly dark one. I feel that this is a bit too light. It's fine. I'll do it. I'll get the colour on. And then I'll add a slightly darker lip line around it in a minute. Let's get a lip brush. Mm, so what colour do I want is the question. Mm, that, right, that whole top row I feel like is too light. That one might be too pink, but let's give it a go. Also very light. Nice colour though. Actually, that gives quite a nice gradient. It's not too harsh. Just take the one next to it, the one smack bang in the middle of the palette. Okay, nice, but I think that first one that I went in with is nicer. I'll put that more in the centre. I do really like their little lip palettes um, I think my favourite out of the four lip palettes that I've got has got to be the one that we got in the advent calendar it comes with like a little lip brush in it as well but the formula is really nice with them so yeah last up we have got the setting spray so this is Babe, it's time to fix up, but fix your vision setting spray. So let's give this one a go. So you can see it's quite a light, it's got like a pearlescent effect to it. Mm, very fineness. That's what I imagine that's going to give me a lovely glow. Yeah, it is. Look at it. <laughs> okay, so. Do you know what? You know, that is annoying me. I want a different lip line. What time do I want? Let's go up on such a flirt. Such a flirt. There we go, that looks a bit better. So, that is everything apart from this, which in all honesty, I probably won't use. Um, I'm not a massive fan of like the tingly type of things. So I will 
I don't know, should I put it in the giveaway or should I list it on Vinted? Comment below, I'll let you guys pick. Um, speaking of giveaway, we're so close, we've got less than, I think we've got like 60 something people and then that's it. Then I will be doing the huge giveaway. Um, but yeah, I haven't obviously put fake lashes on today. I just went in with the mascara. I do like the mascara from this collection, it's nice. Um, but yeah, what do you think of the look? Let me know. Again, we'll be back to colourful stuff next week. Um, I'll get some ideas over the weekend or whatever, but yeah. Next, next lot of makeup videos should be colourful, so. Yeah, but I really like this look. I think it looks cute. I love everything that I've used. That Griffin Primer, really nice. The foundation seems to be sitting on top of it really nicely. So yeah, massive win. But let me know, did you get this collection? Did you get it in the budget box? Did you buy it? Um, let me know. Yeah, that is me done. I hope you enjoyed this little video. If you did, please not forget to like, subscribe, smash the notification bell, leave me a comment down below, all of that good stuff. Socials will be up here. They will also be linked down below. Uh, I will link the collection and the individual items if I can. Um, the collection is up for sale already, so I think I can list everything individually because I'm pretty sure they've listed everything individually on the website. Uh, if not, they definitely have on TikTok. But um, yeah, that is me done. I will love you and leave you and I will see you in the next one. Bye.